Hi. Sunak's been spared for the time being, the so-called Tory rebels abstaining in the Rwanda bill vote. These rebels from various right-wing factions are truly fascist children who in other European countries will be members of the ultra-right neo-fascist parties sitting in governmental coalitions and are almost a majority in today's Conservative Party. The Tories are, by any criteria, openly corrupt to the core, self-serving power freaks when not dedicated to filling their own bank accounts, are waging their versions of the class war, divide and rule and fool. These, this has resulted in over 6 million existing in poverty and a third of the population disenfranchised, abandoned, without any form of representation. And this as the government chips away at the living standards of the working class and the lower orders as they divert wealth forever upwards. The Tories have drifted so far to the right, there's no chance of them reversing the current. In the wake of the crushing, well-deserved forthcoming electoral defeat, which they intend to delay as long as possible, hence Tuesday's climb down, the aftermath will see further movement in the direction of a form of populist type fascism, maybe absorbing the Reform Party UK. All this against the backdrop of mass alienation from our decaying and decadent system. The result has been racism, nationalism, conspiracy theories within a hegemony of right-wing ideas and regressive thinking as people struggle to survive without any viable alternatives arising from below. Such is the frightening reality we've arrived at. It doesn't help that the left, anarchists themselves, contained within shrinking bubbles, are trapped in their own versions of putrid identity politics. This is why the entire gamult of right-wing ideology could become the voice of discontent, rebellion, and take to the streets after Labour elected and deliver nothing. It's important that those of us of an anarcho-malcontent frame of mind prepare for this eventuality to struggle against all forms of authoritarianism, authority itself, and reaction from the right and left, and get ready for something unprecedented, anarchic, bursting forth from below spontaneously, which will be very confused indeed. Bye.